was up all night. Yeah, you know like one of those things that you just, you don't anticipate is gonna happen and it happens. So I didn't get to bed late. I usually uh, get to bed early. I didn't get to bed till late uh, last night. And then, um, I don't know, it's like my dog had to get up and then my son starting at three o'clock in the morning. My dog was up at like midnight and then I was able to fall back asleep for maybe a couple of hours. And then my son was up sick um, with his stomach for, that was it for the rest of the night. So I'm tired. I'm tired for sure. I'm tired. Um, it's now two o'clock, two o'clock in the afternoon for me. And, um, you know, I want to talk about what do you do when you're, when you're tired, you've been up all night and you need a little boost, or maybe you're not up all night, but you need a little bit of a boost. I'm going to talk about what I've done today, because even though I'm tired, I've actually been able to get a lot accomplished. So let's talk about that. Now, this is given that you don't have, have time to rest the next day. Maybe you're going to work or like me, I had other things that I really needed to get done. If you have time to rest, then rest. Great. But I didn't, I didn't have that time today. So what have I done? Well, number one, drink lots of water. I have been drinking and drinking and drinking. I've already had a gallon today. I will drink more. I just need to keep my system very hydrated. Um, I started my day with nitro, Ningxia nitro. It's this great little shot. This is liquid in here. It's a great little shot. Um, it's not full of caffeine. It, it does have some caffeine, but it's not the, uh, you know, that's not what gives you the energy from it. So I start my day with nitro, get a nice boost of energy, um, but not like, you know, the crazy energy. I don't get the crash from it. And then I've had Zing and, and Ningxia as well. Like, I, I mean, I'll drink this as many times as I need to. Quite frankly, I've only had to have it once, but I'll drink it as much as I need to, to get through the day. Also take some B vitamins. I use Super B you know, just make sure you get like a spectrum of B vitamins. These are all good things to, to have for energy. So that's what I'm thinking about today. Like not only energy, but like, but being clear cognitively. So this is what I'm working with for today. Um, deep relief, deep relief on the neck. It's, um, base is really peppermint. So you can just use peppermint if you want, but peppermint itself gives, gives lots of, uh, feelings of energy, just refreshing actually for me. So I've not only been, uh, put it, applying it to my neck and my shoulders, but I've also been smelling it very refreshing. I've also used the peppermint vitality. Any of the white labels from Young Living are ingestible oil. So I've been putting a drop or two on my tongue also just to, um, you know, to keep my energy going. Now here's a couple other important things too. So not just drinking the water, but making sure you eat light. So when you haven't had a lot of sleep, the tendency is to want to have a lot of, uh, at least for me, is to have a lot of carbs. You know, your body gets energy from carbs. So I'd like, if I could have sat down and eaten a pizza, I would have, but I don't do that. But I would, you know, it's like, I, and I know if I had done that, I would have regretted it, number one. Number two, I would have crashed, right? So if you're gonna have carbs, you have to get some carbs. Have some healthy carbs. Make sure you're eating lighter. So have some more fruits. I, I well, actually the first thing I had this morning um, to eat was a banana and it felt really good. It felt very, you know, um, stabilizing for me, it gave me good, clean energy. Again, I'm, I'm looking to like, I don't want these big blood sugar fluctuations. I want to keep really like steady today and keep my energy levels going uh, for that reason. Okay. Go for a walk, get some movement. You obviously, when you haven't slept, it's hard to do anything you know, uh, crazy that requires a lot of energy. So I didn't make it to the gym today for that reason. Um, and I didn't work out at home, but I did go for like a nice gentle walk, just like maybe a mile, mile and a half. I did just nice and gentle, got some sun, you know, just wanted to, again, sun gives you nice energy. So I wanted to keep myself going that way. Um, and then I would say the last thing is, you know, do all this multiple times. So don't think of it as like one shot and then, Oh, but wait, I'm still tired. So do it multiple times. If I have to take another nitro, I will. If I'm going to take more Ningxia or, or Zing or whatever, I'll, I'll do it as many times as I need to to get through the day. Even though I'm tired, like, and when I say I'm tired, I could feel a difference from my normal days, you know, when I have had sleep, but I'm really okay. I mean, it's, I'm really okay. It's two o'clock. I could easily see myself getting to bedtime. I'm hoping I don't have that like crazy crash, you know, when it finally hits you. I know my husband who hasn't been doing what I'm doing today, he already had his crash and he's really struggling today. Um, but I've actually felt really uh, good, really good. And I made a conscious effort to say that I'm going to get through the day feeling energized. And so what tools do I need to do that? So even though I had a craving for certain things that I knew would not work well for me in the end, I didn't give in to those cravings because I wanted to see if I could really keep myself energized throughout the day. Anyway, that's my tip for today. Enjoy.